Well guys, we're testing out a new catfishing opportunity here today. Got a really, really nice farm pond here we're going to be hitting for some channel cats. I've been showing you around. Let me, let me show you another peak here. Looking at it from the south side, looking north toward the dam. And you can see old Mr. Benjamin sitting up there. Right up there in the blue shirt on the dam. All right, while well, the family's out there fishing, I just put out a couple more lines. I'm gonna go ahead and get the old propane stove fired up here and cook some burgers. Got one of these deals that you put over your burners in your kitchen. I thought I'd just go ahead and put that out here in lieu of a really good cooking surface and uh, slide that on there and see how it works. The old flipperoo here. That one's good. So we're a little frozen, so I may have to tend to them a little longer. I may have to flip them again, but we'll see how they turn out. It didn't get much better than this. <laughs> Like to melt our cheese on them. Getting a little activity on the water there. Glassy service is starting to get some rings on it. Don't you wish you could smell things through YouTube? I've often wished that. <laughs> wow, this, this sucker was on while we were eating. Look at this. This is a good fish. I mean, a decent fish. A good eater. Look at that. Got himself all wrapped up in that hydrilla grass. That's the kind of channel cat I'm talking about here, folks kind that you can put on your table 
and we caught we caught these with good old fashioned hot dogs. That's a good eater. Show me stay eater. And he wants back in the pond. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but he ain't going back in the pond. Actually he is, but he's gonna go on a stringer first. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully that will be the... Trying to talk to him here, but he's... I guess he's about talked out. Real. Get him reeled up. He was tangled up in that hydrilla. And Rebecca's going to reel him back all the way in. You got him? Okay, pull him on in. Look at that. That's another decent one. Oh, close to that last one. Give me some slack now. No, it's not as big, but it's... It's an eater. Yeah, we got our catfish fix here for sure, didn't we? Hot dogs, folks. Cool. It looks like his, one of his eyes is gone over here. But this one's still good. Another eater. Good job, Rebecca. Give me five. Oh, daddy's hand's all nasty. Well, the landowner just came down and talked to us a little bit. Man, do we appreciate getting out here, folks. We really thank you for the opportunity. and. We just counted a real privilege and a blessing to get out here and enjoy this land. I wanted to show you something here. This is what we're catching these catfish on. Cheap as cheap can get. Hot dogs, okay? Now I'm not cutting down this brand or anything, but I'm just telling you, this was like, like probably on the bargain shelf or something at Walmart, I'm sure, you know. So, uh, it's all it takes. A little bit of chicken and whatever's left over on the butcher's table I guess to bring them on in so you get them girlfriend <laughs> I saw something on there all right a little bit of fighting going on here. There we go. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. Might have to set that drag a little bit more. I'll, I'll show you. Good fish, babe. <laughs> hey, whose fish is this, Rebecca? Mom. Now yeah. let me just say, okay, Matt puts the hot dogs on he throws them out and we have them lined up on here on the side here and then when we see a fish on then he goes who wants it okay so this is my fish now like everybody it? takes a turn yeah now now what did we decide we decided that oh <laughs> Woo! i'm getting up now <laughs> Woo -wee. he wants to fight you want me to take what we decide when we were out bass fishing what'd you say I don't know, what did okay, I say? I, uh, you want me to take that? Uh, I catch some of them. You want me to take that? You can, no. Put your hand with okay, me. Okay, wow. Say your thing about the catch. Okay, I catch some of them. What did I, I can't remember what. Looper. Oh, Matt, Matt catch most, most of them. I catch some of them, but I cook all of it. Cook all of them. Yeah, but, but it was better on the video that we were bass fishing. Yeah, okay, so. I cook. He catches some of them, or most of them. I catch some of them. But I cook all, all the fish. All of them. All of them, yes. Give us a kiss. Why? Why not? Because you're sweating. Oh my god, I can't do that thing. It's all bloody. Yeah. Yeah, I thought we'd go ahead and slap the scale on this one. Is that reading right around Three, four? 13, four. Four and two. Four one, around four then. Four pound channel. 
Okay, ladies, you know this catfish here? So when you're working out and you're doing the dumbbells, just start working out with the catfish. That'll really excite your husband, let me tell you. <laughs> you know, woman who can catch a fish. Come on, ladies, let's go. And that's the truth. Now we got three good ones and we're waiting on some more. <laughs> That's really bending. Go and pick it up, girlfriend. Set your hook, pull back on it. There you go. All right, now start reeling. Reel, reel. Don't point your tip straight at it. Remember what I said? There is just a lot of stuff in this pond these fish can get hung up on. Another good eater cat. This is our fourth fish. If I can de moss him here. Three pounds, eight ounces. Good job, girlfriend. Hey, and I kept my bait, too. How do you like that? <laughs> I got to keep my bait. <laughs> I guess we'll freshen up. Frog legs, baby. Can I grab it? Frog legs. It's what's for dinner sometime this month. Show the camera. Show the camera. Show the camera. Now don't drop him. Good job, girlfriend. Thank you. Well, we've had our fun, and those legs, they could always be bigger. I'm going to turn him loose. All right, guys, we've had a good day out here in creation, as always. But today, we actually got on some fish, and boy, did we get on them. Got a nice opportunity here to fish a beautiful farm pond. We've still got one person here who needs to get on a fish. I have a feeling that's going to happen for the night's over. But we'll tell you what, we're going we're gonna to end up taking some home and putting them in the freezer and probably having a couple good meals out of them. So thanks again to the folks who own the property. We appreciate it very much. It's always good to get out here. It's just beautiful to... Get out, get away from the TV and the internet and everything else that's going on, you know, and just kind of get back to the basics. So, until next time, one, two, three, happy, happy fishing, fishing to you. Yeah. All together now. <laughs>
That's a wrap.